Blue Jays lose 8-4 in 11 innings to the St. Louis Cardinals, and the Jays deserved this win, but their bullpen implodes and they lose. How did their bullpen implode, may I add, or may you ask? Well, let's start it off. Russell Martin in the very first hitting hits or inning hits a solo shot to center, 1-0 Jays. Then, with the bases loaded, Ryan Goen singles up the middle, two runs score, 3-0 Jays. Then Justin Smoke, uh, with the bases loaded, hits a sacrifice fly, scoring one. It's 4-0 Jays in the seventh. Bottom seven, Joe Biagini comes out. Ah, no, he gives up a run. But, uh, bottom eight. Now, we, uh, Joe Smith's on the mound. He gives up a run. Top Bottom nine, Roberto Osuna's out there. He gives up a two-run shot. This is all in order. Tenth inning, while well, Leon gets the flipping bases loaded, but thank goodness he gets out of it. But oh wait, we get to the eleventh inning, and Ryan Tapera gets a leadoff triple. They walk two guys to get the four at any base. They get one out. They get J.P. Howell in the game, and he gives up a grand flipping slam. <sighs> Matt Lados pitched a fantastic game. You know. I was really, really impressed with what he did today. He went six innings, giving up only three hits, no runs, four walks, four strikeouts. And, you know, I think he only pitched, what, 80, 82 pitches. He could have gone another inning. But I understand why they didn't want him to go out the next inning, because Yadier Molina hits him well. He was the leadoff guy in that inning. It made sense. And then you could technically go seven, eight, nine inning, bang, ball game. But no. The bullpen sucked tonight. That is, or this afternoon, that's the reason we lost. We had a game, a win, wrapped up. And it just it just falls apart. Roberto Osuna, I got to admit, is kind of starting to worry me. He's made one save and blown three. His ERA is, what is it now? Is it North 6? Now it's 7.5. And... A half. and his velocity on his fastball has dropped, what, two, three miles an hour. That's scary. Because that's what he's dynamite, man. I elevate that 96-mile-an-hour fastball. It's golden. But that's not happening right now for him. He's throwing 93, 94 and missing spots. Oh, my gosh. Everything was going well. The defense was playing great. They were getting great plays. They were coming up with some nice timely hits, some sacrifice fly, some small ball. Things were looking good. And it literally just fell apart. They could have won their first series of the season. They could have ended that win-loss, win-loss streak. But no. They're now 6-15. They literally got a rebound of really fast because they play at 7 o'clock tonight. You guys might even be watching this video post-game tonight. And it might be a different story. But they sucked late in the game. They lost, and it hurts. Now, you could say a few things. You could say Kevin Pillar, oh, he made that catch, then fell, uh, bounced out of his glove. That's one run. Well, yeah, you could have said that. You could also say that the uh, the Jays had runners at first and third, less than two out, when Smoke hit that sacrifice fly, like the play after that, and I think Martin struck out. You could have added that run while well, you didn't have to worry about it. But they didn't, and it shouldn't have mattered. But they, they, ah. Uh, this is where we start pulling our hair out because we're like, we want to have faith in this team. Even the guys that look good this year, like Joe Smith, I thought he's looked pretty darn good this season. He finds a way to give up a couple hits and just not look right. You know, he. It's just so frustrating. It is so frustrating being a Jays fan right now. Watching this team get leads, hold leads for a while, and then just out of nowhere, just. <laughs> fall down the hill and explode. On a positive note, Bautista was two for three. Pilar was two for six. He continues to rake. Russell Martin, obviously, with the home run and scored a couple runs. Smoke got a hit. He's still doing well. 
And if you want to see Kendrys Morales with the pinch hit single, uh, Ryan Goins with a with a single and, and a couple RBIs, he's hitting 281 on the season. Very good for Ryan. We just we got to rebound quick tonight. You can win the series still tonight if you get the win. Casey Lawrence is on the mound for the Jays. And, uh, I mean, when you got Adam Wainwright, the veteran, on the mound for the Cardinals, not having a great season, but Casey Lawrence is a new guy, young guy, so who knows what we're going to see. God, this just grinds my gears. It just, Because you could have won that game, and you could have gone in tonight looking for the sweep, but instead you blow it, and now you're looking for the series win, and just pray you can get the series win. All right, so you know what, guys? That is going to do it for this one. If you guys enjoyed the video and you guys are as frustrated as I am, hit that like button. I do appreciate that. Hit that subscribe button if you guys have not already. Comment down below. You know, what you guys think? I mean, just what you guys think of this game? I mean, what can you guys pinpoint? What the heck is the problem with, with this team right now? I mean, if it's not one thing, it's the next. If it's not the offense crapping themselves, it's the bullpen or the starting pitching as an off night. or It's just something every game. All right, and uh, we'll talk to you guys tonight. Raptors edition is they're in game six. We're looking for a positive um, as they look to win that series and take on the Cleveland Cavaliers in the second round. That would be great. That would be great to end the series now and not have to worry a little bit. You can take a take a breather a little bit. All right. Uh, we'll also talk to you guys. Jays edition tonight has uh, the Jays look for a series win. Casey Lawrence, Adam Wainwright, 7-15, first pitch. We need a win, man. We need to win this series. We need to be the first one of the season and maybe start something decent. Just a frustrating loss. But you got to rebound. We'll talk to you guys later tonight.